In Akwaibum State, the State House of Assembly Speaker Nyakan Basi has charged the incoming members of the 8th Assembly to represent their constituents judiciously. Basi gave the advice during the valedictory plenary session of the 7th Assembly. ADBN House of Assembly correspondent David Song completes the report. June 10, 2019, witnessed the inauguration of the 7th Assembly into the legislative arm of Akwaibom State. The inauguration paid host to 26 democratically elected House of Assembly members to represent their local government areas. The 7th Assembly has successfully passed 26 bills into law. 10 outstanding bills have passed second reading, while 8 bills have passed first reading. The Speaker of the Akwaibom State's 7th Assembly, Anikan Basi, while giving his valedictory speech, appreciated his colleagues for their support, advising members of the 8th Assembly to continue on the legacies set by the 7th Assembly. I sincerely thank all our members for the support and good pressure given to me and the leadership of the 7th Assembly. Most importantly, I thank our most cherished gentlemen of the press, the management and staff of the Assembly, the civil societies, labor unions, and the people of Akwaibom State for their unwavering support and encouragement. Akwaibom House of Assembly Deputy Speaker Felicia Bassi, leader of the House Udokiri Anakban, and other members of the 7th Assembly took turns to give their valedictory speech. Mr. Speaker, the 7th Assembly, which you preside, and I was behind you, backing you seriously, so that we can have peace. The House of Assembly should not be harmonious all the time. There should be fracas. Members coming in, don't allow anybody to deceive you. There should be... You have to disagree. To agree. But I want to join all our colleagues in appreciating the opportunity God has given me to serve in the Seventh Assembly and appreciate God and give thanks and glory to God for sustaining the Seventh Assembly. We came in and we are all bound out to be complete. I came into this assembly as a beneficiary of the Not Too Young to Run Bill. At barely 26, I was inaugurated into this hallow chamber to represent the good people of Nsuribu. Mr. Speaker, in the past four years, I can pick my chest and say that I have not failed the young people of our private state. The Eighth Assembly will be inaugurated on Friday, 9 June 2023, as minds look forward to the implementation of their mandate. David Isong, ADBN News.